Hello everyone and welcome to another video. So if you are a gamer like me, you know about the game shop and game service called Steam where you can buy and play games. Uh, there's a service within Steam called Steam Client Web Helper and it looks something like this on your task manager. And uh, if you know, it is taking up a lot of memory. So if you can see, there's nothing running on my computer other than my browser. And uh, after my browser, it is like the biggest are uh, the most expensive memory intensive task that is running on my computer so even if i run other things uh, it is still going to be in the top five and it is taking up a lot of memory something that is very unnecessary for a game library or a game shop right so today we are going to fix this we are going to make sure that the steam client web helper takes minimum amount of memory uh, this is not something that you can stop because it is required there's a lot of services that are running within it only some of them are taking up that amount of memory, which is not necessary. So first of all, what you need to do is open Steam. So you'll go to Steam and you have your library opened up. Now you need to go to this icon that says Steam and within it, you'll see a settings menu option. Click on settings and you'll see a window like this. Once you have this window, you need to click on interface. Once you are in the interface, you need to search for an option called GPU Accelerated Rendering in WebViews and enable Hardware Video Decoding. These both options, you need to make sure that these are disabled. So after each disable, you will be, need, you will be required to uh, restart the Steam client. So first, I will disable the GPU Accelerated Rendering. So as you can see, it is asking me to restart the software, not the computer. So I'll restart Steam. It's restarting now let's wait for a few seconds and we'll then disable the second option that is needed so these are the two options that make the software run smoothly but this is not the software that you're using to actually play the games. This is, this is not the game that you're playing. It's just the shop and the library. So I don't think these uh, options are actually necessary. If you have a medium spec computer, then this is going to be actually you know, like lagging your game. So it will cost you some frames when you're playing. So go back to the interface. Now this GPU accelerated is disabled. Next, you want to disable the hardware video decoding. So again, restart. One more time, it will restart. All right. So as you can see, we have now disabled these two options. One is the GPU accelerated rendering and the other one is hardware video decoding. So both of them are disabled. Now we go to our task manager and we see that there is some difference, but it has not made a lot of difference yet. So if the memory that we have reduced so far is not enough, and if you want to go further and reduce more memory, then what you need to do now is next, we are going to run a command that will run the Steam app without the browser. So here you can see there's a URL, there's all of this, and it is actually because uh, Steam is running a browser and it is loading all this content through the browser. So if you see that Edge is taking up a lot of memory because it's a browser, similarly Steam is also running a browser, and what we are going to do is disable the browser within Steam so that we can only launch the games from the Steam and nothing else. So uh, this might be just temporary. So what you need to do is uh, first of all, stop Steam completely. Click right click on Steam and click on exit Steam. This will uh, stop the software from running at all. And as you can see, it is now not there on the list. So as you can see, Steam is no, no longer on the list. And what next we need to do is go to run command so just go to your search and click on run and here you can see uh, a run command alternatively what you can do is click on window plus r 
so this will option this is the option that will open up here you need to enter the command on the screen that is location of the steam so my steam is in program files x86 steam.exe so i'm going to run the steam with a no browser flag and the mini game list so as soon as i do it you'll be able to see that steam is now opening but as soon as the browser had opened up it closed and the only part that is now open is the game list so even if you close uh, steam and then you open it again from here or here it's only going to open the list of games rather than the entire browser and the library so this is going to save a lot of memory it will take a few minutes for the memory to uh, go down in the list but since it already had opened the browser but you can see that it will slowly go down and this is how you reduce the memory usage on steam client web helper so you can find the command in the description of the video to run the steam client without the browser so this is how you reduce the steam memory usage and uh, you can run the games faster than before without steam taking up a lot of memory so i hope this helped and if you like the video click on the like button if you are new to the channel click on the red subscribe button below to stay updated with the latest content till then have a good one guys